Hello, I'm going to try to uh, build the project from scratch. I'm going to review the things that we have done in this course. Um, and so we are going to start by turning on and off a LED. So I'm going to bring from the menu and on the right one LED. And then we're going to need a resistor for, for this. LED to control the energy flow. This LED usually where we are using 220 ohms and now we need to connect this. To connect we make a click and then we have this line that go anywhere and then we do another click and now it's connected. So we have from this point negative to this line in here and the resistor is taking this negative connection to the other boost in here connecting the LED. And now we are going to take one point here and connect it to this point. This is not nice. We can uh, make a double click in the line and, and drag to make a connection that looks nicer if we want to and even we can change color if we need to but right now we need to move forward so we are going to use the code in here and we are going to use the output so we need to bring two of these and then I'm going to shuffle them around I'm going to make two small delays. We connect all these together. We are using the pin 7 here, so I'm going to switch this to 7. Oh, I bring the wrong one here. This is going to the trash can in here. So this will be our first small test code and we start simulation and we can see that it should be okay. We have another point of failure here and now it's turning on and off, on and off. So. We are going to hide the code for a moment and then we are going to bring a push button here and we are going to use our resistor here and we need a signal here from positive And then we are going to take a signal. This will be our, our input. So we are going back to the code that we have and we are going to put a, a control that will be take this and we are going to to use a variable And now we are going to use some math here. And we need to take one input. Here we are using pin number two.
So when we press the button, it start to cycling. So this is what we need to make a traffic light, basically. And with this, thinking with this, we can then build uh, our final project. We will need to add more, more lights, but basically this will be our setup for the traffic light.